This episode of Sojino's Best is brought to you by Jack Threads. Hey, what's up, guys? Sojino's Best here, here in my glasses, and I'm about to do another What's in My Dock video. Where I'm about to show you some of my favorite applications that I'm currently running on my Mac right now. And the first application I'm going to show you is called Window Tidy. You can't see it right now. But what I'm going to do is I'm open up a couple of uh, browser windows here like so and this application allows you to manage all the open windows that you have on your desktop and just make it a little bit a little bit more less cluttered so anyway so if i drag on this application window here while i have this window uh, tidy application running you'll see here i have this little launcher down here and i can drag this uh, window right over here and i'll place it on the right side of the screen or i can drag this one and place this on the left hand side of the screen and you see you do have uh, multiple options here you can put that one right smack that in the middle and also too um i customize a couple of these as well so i'm open up my twitter and my mail client here and I already already went to where I need to put them. But anyway, I'm going to show you right here. So I customized these two on the right here. So I want this window to go right there because I like to have these, these small application windows kind of grouped together on my desktop. And it's that easy. And again, you can go here and customize and make your own um, individual uh, tidy preference pane right here. These are some of the standard ones there. Uh, you can add them and customize them to where you want to place the, uh, the application window. You can name it whatever you want to. So I really like this application. It keeps you a little bit less cluttered um, on your desktop. And that is called Window Tidy. Now, the next application I'm going to show you is called Total Finder. If you're probably looking at it right now, you probably say, okay, what is the difference about this between the regular Finder? Where if you notice right up here at the top, you have this tabbed option just like you'll find in Google Chrome or any other web browser. And uh, you can open up another tab here. So I want to tab here for my applications. I want to tab here. Uh, uh, for airdrop basically you can have multiple tabs open and once you start using this application i just started i just downloaded this yesterday it comes uh, with a free 14-day trial i will be buying this one uh, you you just wanted to yourself why hasn't apple done this yet because just imagine browsing the web right now in your regular browser and you know everybody has tab browsing now just imagine not having tab browsing anymore you had to do everything in one single window or open up multiple uh web uh, op open up multiple browser windows so this is really makes your life easier and have this tab browsing right here and finally just makes all the sense in the world and this application may do something different i don't know I really haven't looked into it because I've just been using the, the tab option but I think this is the main big thing of this application but it's, it's worth it to me just to be able to have tab browsing now in my find I probably should have researched this application a little bit more uh, anyway right, the next application I'm going to show you today is called Raven this is part of my favorite application out of the bunch as well uh, this is a very nice clean slick looking web browser it's really really fast as far as loading up uh, websites but also too has its own web app shop where it turns some of the most popular websites out there like Facebook and Amazon into their own web application now it doesn't have you know a ton and ton of these already but they're still updating this daily uh, but it has some of the most popular ones out there so basically i have this amazon web app installed here they're all free and right here on the left hand side i got this little cool little uh, toolbar this little sidebar right here and so now if I go to the Amazon application you see it loads it up just like that and I can go to my wish list I can go to my shopping cart just by clicking right there on the side I don't have to, I don't have to search on, the, on the, the actual page itself to find those things these are some of the quick little links or quick little shortcuts to them they have an iCloud one, so if you're in your mail, you can switch very, very quickly to go to your calendar, your contacts. Twitter one, which I like. Uh, this is basically can replace the Twitter app almost. Um, you see here, you can go to your, your mentions there if you wanted to. As soon as it loads up, load it up, load it up. Uh, and also, you can go straight to your timeline, YouTube one as well, and some of your favorite videos. And again, it has an upload button, so you can upload very quickly. And that, oh, I can go on and on and on, but it's a very, very nice, slick, clean look, looking web browser. And I like it so far, and I'm actually been using it um, on a daily basis here. So I really like that web browser right, the next application i'm going to show you is called sparrow this is a very nice simple easy clean mail client for mac os 10 and this looks a lot like the twitter application now formerly known as tweety app um, that's on the mac right now but that's not a bad thing at all because very it's very minimum doesn't take too much space but you have all your emails right then and there for you and you can add your gmail you can add your uh, icloud account uh, no matter which one you want to add to it you want to start a new message it, it just really really fast as you can see it's really fast as far as opening things up so i'm not going to go through any of my emails and show you because i probably have my personal email in there somewhere but anyway Anyway, uh, I really like this mail client. You can find this in the uh, actual the Mac App Store right now as well. So this is called Sparrow. I really like this one. And the last application I'm going to show you today is called Alfred. This is a very fast, easy um, application launcher or just looking through certain things on your computer. You can find this very quickly using this application. So the default, once you download it, is option spacebar to go and activate Alfred. And uh, now you can just go in and start typing in. Now I have it, I think it's set to um, search my applications only, I believe. So I can go through, start looking through some of my applications here. So boom, Cantrus application. If I was looking at, I can go ahead and launch that if I wanted to. Uh, ScreenFlow, I can go ahead and launch that if I wanted to. Or the Logitech application that I use sometimes. Um, it's just something that's very fast. It's a lot faster to use than Spotlight. Definitely a lot faster to use than Finder as well. So this is Alfred. I really like it a lot. You can customize the, the look of it a little bit as well in there. But this is Alfred. Very simple, very easy, very fast. So anyway, guys, this brings us to the, the last of my applications. But before we head out of here, it's going to take one. Let's look at our sponsor for this video. 
And today's sponsor is Jack Threads. Jack Threads has some of the coolest clothes from some of the most popular brands out there like Hurley, Kid Robot, and Stussy. And they offer up to 80%, yes, 80% off of these clothes. That's a pretty good deal. So they, they serve mostly street or surf wear and things like that. But most people can find something like a hat or some sunglasses or a shirt, some pants, some jeans, some shoes, almost any different type of accessory as well from this website. Now this is an invite only shopping club online, but because you are a social knows best viewer, you can go to jackthreads.com forward slash SKB and go to start shopping right now. So go ahead and check it out. Go to jackthreads.com forward slash skb all right guys again thanks for watching this video please leave a comment down below but what you think about this video and what you think about the application also too if you have any other applications that you might want to see me check out in another video leave that comment down below as well and again thanks for watching guys and i will catch you later peace